Most of the time, uh, schools just offer a business program and then you get your master's in HR. So it is pretty rare that Baylor offers a specific HR program. With the HR degree here, you get like a generalist degree. You don't have like a training specific degree or a compensation specific degree. It's just a general degree and then from there you can end up being in compensation, you could be in talent acquisition, recruiting, like me you could be in training and development, a business partner, HR manager. They're just limitless opportunities. I would say the benefit of a mentorship versus an internship is that it's really what the student wants to get out of it. When you have the time, you work around right your class schedule, you can say, hey Barry, I want to come down on this day, and then maybe we focus on benefits or we focus on training and development. Well, we learn a lot of great things about HR in class, but to have a real life example and to be able to go see what it's really like in a company makes me see what I'm getting into and what I really want to do and figure out what part of HR I want to Go to. The HR department is really great about giving us hands-on tasks. We partnered with Sally Beauty in an attempt to provide them with basically a model of how they should find employees or potential employees, how they should hire them, and then evaluate how they perform. We're definitely interacting with a real-life company, which I think makes it pretty special because they might actually use this, and that's really cool because that shows that our work is being validated and that what we're doing matters. Part of HR, one of the biggest things, is interacting with and helping people. That has exponential impacts on both the employee, their families, and so HR is a really great way to impact people, and that's what I love about it.